Dr. Sindhari Mace, the Sonoma County Health Officer, and I'm here to share the latest updates in coronavirus in Sonoma, Sonoma County with you. As of yesterday, July 9th, we have 1,561 confirmed cases, 774 active, an increase of 42 cases in the last 24 hours, 773 have recovered, and we've done 57,209 coronavirus tests to date up uh, 552 in the last 24 hours. Today, I'd like to provide an update for you about how Sonoma County is doing with the metrics that the state of California is monitoring. I'd like to let you know that we were notified that Sonoma County will be placed on the state COVID-19 monitoring or watch list today. This also kicks off a three-day period beginning today of targeted engagement with California Department of Public Health, which means that the state will work with the county to uh, set up calls and provide technical assistance during this time. If the county's coronavirus data does not improve over the next 72 hours or three days, the county will then be subject to the new restrictions as part of the statewide actions designed to slow the spread of These restrictions could start as soon as Monday, July 13th. The closures would affect certain businesses who will no longer be allowed to operate indoor activities, but will be allowed for outdoors when industry guidelines are followed. These include restaurants, wineries and tasting rooms, movie theaters, zoos, museums, and card rooms, bars, clubs, breweries, and distilleries, whether operating indoors or outdoors are not allowed unless they operate a restaurant uh, or have a meal service, food truck on the licensed premises in which case they will be allowed to operate outdoors only. Alcohol can only be served alongside a meal, not alone. We must all work together to slow the spread and limit the time that we're under these new restrictions. So remember all the mitigation measures. Remember to wear your facial covering when in public indoor spaces and outdoors when unable to maintain physical distancing of six feet. Frequently wash your hands, stay home when you're sick, and uh, try to uh, adhere to all of the mitigation measures. Thank you for all for listening, and we'll be back to provide you with an update on Monday. Stay safe and be well.